Shots ring out in Oklahoma when officers discover an armed fugitive hiding under a mattress in the back of a trailer. Go, 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 go. Shots fired, shots fired. It happened at about 10.25 a.m. on November 15th in Oklahoma City, Oklahoma. Officers were told a suspect with an out-of-state warrant was seen entering a trailer. The man, identified as Timothy Johnson, was not seen leaving. Responding officers spoke with Jennifer Gurner, the woman who lives in the trailer. She gave police permission to search inside. She told her to leave. It's her trailer. Sammy, this is the police department. If you're in here, you need to make yourself known. Body camera video shows multiple officers searching the trailer for Johnson. Sammy. Hey. When officers lift a mattress in the back of the trailer, they find Johnson armed with a pistol hiding in a storage area. Get After that, shots ring out. Go, 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 go. Shots fired, shots fired. Body camera video shows officers returning to the trailer in an attempt to take Johnson into custody and secure the area. Come out with your hands up. Come out with your hands up. Come out with your hands up. Come. Seconds after officers go back inside the trailer, shots ring out again. That's when one of the officers inside is hit with debris. I'm hit, I'm hit. We're stuck inside the trailer. I'm hitting in the face. Body camera video then shows officers attempt to make contact with Johnson again before leaving the trailer to find a safe area. We gotta get out. Timothy, you come out with your hands up. Back out of the trailer. The Oklahoma City Police Department's tactical team later arrived and found Johnson dead on the scene. Investigators later discovered Jennifer Gurner gave police consent to search her trailer, knowing Johnson was armed and hiding inside. She was arrested and now faces charges of harboring a fugitive. The officer who was injured was treated at a nearby hospital and later released. Now, all three officers involved in the shooting are on leave pending the outcome of an investigation. For the latest developments in this story and all things true crime, stay with Long Crime Network. I'm Sierra Gillespie.